One of the things I really love getting to do is I work on the practicum, both for offering a class to the students and also helping them as they do team-based projects. We have sponsors, and the sponsors have live, real problems. These may be things the students are solving or exploring, doing research on. They have 14 weeks. What makes it different from things like an internship is the students are involved in the scheduling and scoping the problem and really work in partnership with the sponsors. And it's very different from something like, you know, turn to page 44 in your textbook and answer the odd problems. Um, this is just a very hands-on, immersive capstone project. For the first time, we're also um, exploring doing practicum in Pittsburgh. We have tremendous tech opportunities coming up in Pittsburgh as well. So what we're doing now is we're doing a pilot program and we're introducing the practicum to the students who are in Pittsburgh. So for all of the projects, the students are well supported with a class, which I teach, and the practicum class tries to give them kind of just-in-time uh, skills and knowledge that they need to really be successful with the projects. Uh, and we also have a faculty advisor for every one of the projects. One of the things that's been fun is to watch how the, the projects come in and the students pair off to them. We get a mapping between the skill set that the companies need and the skills that the students have and then the student interests. And we um, cross-connect those to build teams. And the teams are three to six students. Um, so they're really a nice size to get things done in the time that we have. One of the projects we're working on is with a small startup called Bitclave. And Bitclave is working on blockchain issues. And in particular, the students are working on using the blockchain for privacy. So right now, super hot set of topics. This one is fun because we have a faculty member who's on their board of directors. So we have these ties between industry and faculty, and we're located in Silicon Valley. And so again, we can give the students the opportunity to really be on the ground floor of things and to come up with these very new and interesting technologies and figure out how to apply them in new ways. So those relationships have proven really fruitful for the companies as well. Um, and we're really looking for ways to be able to, to deepen those relationships and not just have it be a quick project and done. So for example, sometimes we make introductions beyond the Information Networking Institute. There's a group out in San Francisco. For the work that they needed, um, they needed things that our students and our faculty don't do in some cases. So I made introductions for them to the, the groups in Pittsburgh. And we'll wind up with a variety of, of different parts of Carnegie Mellon working with them. They're sponsoring a practicum, they may wind up hiring some of our students, and they're working with two different teams in Pittsburgh. So the really nice thing for the practicum sponsors, and I think our, our alumni will back this up, is that INI is a, a real family kind of orientation. And so we welcome them into that for ongoing relationships so we can kind of build those bridges and get a tremendous amount of value, not just over 14 weeks, but over years.